Okay, we've just started putting some wow bond glue on. I'm just getting a paintbrush and I'm just flattening it down a wee bit. So when we do put our small pieces of mirror on, the glue's not gonna come up through the gap. So that's just flattening it a wee bit. Okay. Change glues <laughs> running out there, so well bond good too. I was using prep glue before, and um, either wall I bounce between the two. Same thing again, just flatten them down a little bit, and then I'm going to work this end and slowly come together. So run this end that way, we can just adjust if we need to. Okay, now we've got our borders in place, we can um, fill in the background. Um, I've chosen a nice stained glass called Melon, we just got in, it's actually quite a pretty colour. Um, these are all in random size pieces, so I'm just going to cut them down to a lot of um, smaller sizes. Just do random sizes to start with because you want to trim them to fit them in. So long as we've just got some rough sort of pieces, we can start with those. I by trimming to fit them in, so always look for the shape and then you just can trim it down so it fits in nicely. I've just taken that little bit off the end and that's made it fit in nicely. Uh, next piece here. I think I'm going to keep them sort of relatively smallish. And I've got the gaps quite close together, that way the green would be a nice overpowering background. Always think colour. about your second piece, every piece you do, always think about how the next one's going to go in nicely. And that way you can just trim and um, get them fitting a lot neater. Um, for example, let's just do one here. So I'm basically looking at that shape's going to be perfect for here. So I'm just going to need to cut that off. And I'm not going to have much joy getting a little tiny tile in there, so if I can cut that, I'm going to cut that that way, that's going to give it a nice tidy area, I'll show you what I mean. And now you can get sort of one piece in there, it looks a bit tidy, so it's just about always thinking about your next piece ahead of time. So I might put that one in there, same thing again. I'm going to cut it down. Just 
chick under there. Let's think it's about like that. Perfect. So trim to fit. And then you get a nice little jigsaw puzzle piece back together.